such a time as this. And welcome, welcome back to For Such a Time as This, the place where there is no such thing as a silent, as a silent witness. Want to play again uh, in in the Socialist Republic of Illinois? <laughs> it is election time. There's there's an election coming, uh, April fourth. Many local school boards and and lumped in with that is the 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 chief executor of the third largest city in the country, Chicago, Illinois. With that said, I'd like to read Psalm 210. It is a psalm which reminds us that elected officials will be held accountable to God Almighty. They will give a, they were given account of how they ruled. Psalm 210, now therefore kings be wise, be warned, O rulers of the earth, serve the Lord with fear. Rejoice with trembling. Kiss the sun, lest he be angry, and you perish. You perish in the way, for his wrath is quickly kindled. Blessed are all who take refuge, who take refuge in him. Well, it is February, I'm sorry, it is March 2nd, 2023. Uh, I had a friend up on Facebook say, uh, in reaction to the uh uh, memorial primaries, ding dong, you know the rest, with a picture of Mayor Lightfoot. Um, Lightfoot got only the third uh, third place, so she is not in the runoff. Chicago Memorial runoff will be against Paul Vallis and Brandon Johnson. Paul Vallis used to be the head of the CP. Chicago Public School System, CPS, and I believe Brandon Johnson is a commissioner in Chicago. Um, Vallis is backed by the uh, Union for the Police, and Johnson is backed by the Unions of Teachers. <sighs> the rumor in the Chicago area is that Johnson, Brandon Johnson, is to the left of Lightfoot. To which I said, that's impossible, doesn't exist. Then I ran across this video when researching the issue. Um, um, this is the man who's in the runoff to be the mayor of Chicago. Here it is. Loot because they, that's how they can eat? The real answer is, how do we make sure, the question is, how do we make sure that people can eat? Look, no one is gonna condone, um, you know, behavior that, that quite frankly speaks to a level of desperation. So you're not, people you're not condoning not, looting? I, I'm saying that people are acting out of desperation. We don't want a society that is acting out of desperation, but you have to pay attention to the cries that people have. By so you're, you're not that, condoning looting? There's no way to, to, to embrace that. What I'm saying is you can't condone the looting that corporations continue to do every single day when they take tax dollars from black, brown, white folks all over the city of Chicago so that they can turn a profit. Ladies and gentlemen, that is quite possibly the next mayor of Chicago. For such a time as this. <laughs> 